I just interviewed your buddy Monroe. Fascinating. He was very forthcoming about the Mort Greylong debacle. He doesn't know shit from Shinola about fuck all. Do you kiss your mother with that mouth? No dot but I kiss your mother with this mouth. Fabulous tongue action. By the way, did you teach her that? It's been a long day, Nastia. What is the cadre's sudden interest in some pathetic soap opera? Is that all the alternate music scene on Tilly Island is to you? One dickhead with a paint by numbers Hitler video does not act music scene. Make. The cadre hates it on you, free thinkers. Start coloring outside the lines, more like free haters. You never did tell me why you are not involved in the music scene as a performer. What possible advantage is there, to pouring out your soul, for a bunch of shithouse rats? Surely you don't mean everyone, no, not everyone. But the assholes ruin it for the rest of us, and we feel we can be of tremendous help in this matter. You mean the cadre? You know I can be specific. But you are looking for specific information from me? We want the name and phone number of this big time Los Angeles producer that wrote the unasked for review of the double R band performance at the concerto on the grill last year. That's the asshole we want to speak to. What makes you think this not even exists? Whatever do you mean? What would the music producer be doing wasting his precious time, watching a small time badly paid and ill-treated? I saw the Leopards Club brand that, and they have the same lack of regard for local talent, as the rest of the venues here, actually. Much worse, and besides, what kind of shrink dink, writes a review of a band's performance, unasked, and then doesn't have the sack to include a contact phone number or address, other than some phony sounding Gmail address, that any person can put together in 10 minutes. Fool me once. We know that the guitar player set up a Gmail account under the same name, with just one number separating them, just to prove that saying you are a boy dowler doesn't make you boy dowler. I'm getting a massive headache. And you wonder why I don't play in the sandbox with these creeps. But you still like the band? Why wouldn't I? They're just a bunch of guys trying to play some decent music. And I'm getting that it's a crime to do that. It is to people who don't have enough talent to compete, so they try to drag everybody down to their level. I think they're on to you, Smokey. I think I just soiled myself. Get a grip, Pissant.